Here we are, WL. So here we have a trailer for Deadpool 3 or Multiverse of Madness 2. <laughs> it's the same thing. Like, literally the same thing that I saw happened with uh, before the release of Multiverse of Madness is happening right now all over again before the release of Deadpool 3 with all the fan theories and the rumors and all the shit. People will never learn it. So I guess the reviews of this movie is going to be based on, you know, how well they do with the with the cameos and, you know, whatever fan theory, whatever rumors like that. Yet yeah. this movie can be shit, but with all the cameos that are going to appear, people are just going to pretend it's great. Uh, but I don't really care about all those shit. So I'm just here to watch this movie for Deadpool and for Wolverine. So Wolverine is like one of my favorite uh, you know, comic book characters of all time. It was great seeing him as Wolverine for all those years. And uh, finally, what we hear, we heard that he was not going to come back. But I don't know what happened. Then he decided to come back again. So I don't know if this is going to be a like a one time thing or is he going to you know be continuing this role? Like I have no clue honestly. So um, I'm a huge Wolverine fan. Um, I like Logan. I like uh, the Wolverine, and I might get hate for saying this, but I did like I liked watching um, X Men Origins Wolverine. Like I didn't care about anything else. I watched that movie specifically for Wolverine. So please don't come at me for saying I liked that movie. Uh, but yeah, um, I'm really excited for this movie. Uh, so I think this is like the only MCU movie coming out this year because all the other uh, Marvel movies that are coming out this year are all Sony. Like, Venom 3 is coming out this year, uh, Craven is coming out, Madam, Madam Web is coming out, so, um, yeah, uh, this is gonna be the only MCU movie this year, that, so, um, I, I think, it, like, it's been a while since we had, like, only one MCU movie, and even this one, technically, like, this is just the movie that is gonna be transitioning into the MCU, so it's not exactly MCU, but it kinda is, but you, you know what I mean, right? So, uh, yeah, anyways, let's get into the trailer. Happy birthday to you. Wait, why is Shadowstar there? Okay, um... Wait, I, I thought... What? Wait, wait I, I get her being back, but when... Why why is Shadowstar back? It's been a I don't know. Two years, for sure. He hated Shadowstar, though. That's and he didn't he bring him back, so whatever. I'm the luckiest man alive. Not the wig. Make a wish, buddy. Who's asking? Oh god, it's not the TVA, bro. Whoa, 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 ah, whoa, whoa. Is that supposed to be scary? Pegging yeah. isn't new for me, friendo, but it is for Disney. No, not the wig. You didn't prune the place. <sighs> Mr. Wilson, you appear to have soiled yourself while unconscious. I wasn't unconscious. Who are you? Why am I here? Walk with me. I don't know how to feel about this though, but sure. Wait. You are special. This is your chance to be a hero among heroes. <laughs> Holy shit. I smell what you're stepping in, Sensei. Uh, your little cinematic universe is about to change forever. Okay. Oh, wait, that was uh, Wolverine in the suit. I the one of his uh marvel jesus marvel jesus <laughs> oh yeah that's the uh uh 20th century uh logo at the back shit Oh wait. Wait 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 Holy shit that's pyro what? That's pyro from the uh X2 and uh the last stand. That's the same guy. I almost I wait, I was like, where did I I I didn't notice him for a second and I was like wait pyro that Yep, okay. I I I'm get I, yeah whatever you know what I'm I'll continue first. Wait. Right. 
Yeah, just by the hair, you know, come on. You don't need to wait for anything else. The hair gave it away. Don't just stand there, you ape. Give me a hand up. Nope, I'm actually okay. Thank you very much. Yeah. Great. Uh, wait, speaking of pyro. Again, I did not... I. Like, that, that, that shit went over so fast, I was like, wait, 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 what do you mean Pyro? Like, okay, it's the same actor, so obviously he looks older, like, what, 20, like, oh, what, about 20 years. So, technically he didn't die, right? Because I think they did say he died by, uh, you know, getting killed by the Sentinels, but then since Logan went back and turned back time, technically that would mean all of that didn't happen. So, it means Pyro might still be alive, so... Could that be the same pyro or is it like a doppelganger or or a variant for that the TVA brought in? So this TVA looks obviously different from the one from Loki. And um, I mean, the Loki shows, uh, shows, you know, season one and two was literally like a pointless show, honestly. But, <laughs> but um, this, I, I don't know what to expect right now. So they brought Wade to, it's like, uh, like, because he did change a lot of stuff. And, yeah, speaking of changing stuff, like, why is Shadowstar there? Because technically he didn't bring back Shadowstar and he hated him. So I just don't understand why. Because could that be, like, a, I don't know, like, the director not paying attention or whatever. But I don't know. So he did, uh, he, he did kill one of his, uh, you know, the, the Deadpool from uh, X-Men Origins. He killed himself from playing uh, uh, Green Lantern. I mean, you know, killing Ryan Reynolds from playing Green Lantern. Um, he saved his girl and uh, he killed the baby Hitler uh, or, you know, she tried to. Well, what else did he change? Um, yeah, he saved Peter. Right, he saved Peter, but not Shatterstar. So, um, so yeah, I guess that's the reason why uh, the TVA came and brought him. So, uh, so, yes. So, I, I really do not know what to expect. And we did see him being in the snow a lot. So, I don't know if that's like a separate place. Because when the TVA, they showed, uh, you know, in the little screens, they showed scenes from Age of Ultron. And then it fast forward to him being in a place of snow. So, I'm wondering if he's in age of ultron at that moment or because since there was this this um the 20th century uh thing and uh, i think i saw a light so i think the 20th century logo thing might all be in the void that got pruned i think i think that might be it and i don't know maybe a lot of this a lot of the uh scenes in this movie might take place in the void which I, I, I just, you know, I'm just saying, you know, I'm just saying, yeah, I'm not really sure. So maybe because it looks like a lot of the, the stuff might be happening in the void and things that got pruned. So um, I I think I saw Charles, was it somebody who was bald? I, I don't know. I think I saw someone who was bald. So I, I don't know. It, it was really quick, but I'm not sure. So Wolverine, oh yeah, speaking of Wolverine, we also saw the uh, uh, Wolverine who wears a suit and the, and the eye patch. Uh, so, but that looked really different from, I don't even know what second was that in that video, so I'm not even going to bother looking looking back, but uh, that did not look like Hugh Jackman, so is it possible if somebody else is playing, uh, you know, that, that version of uh, Wolverine, so um, I'm glad because this is a teaser, so I'm glad they didn't show us any Wolverine except for that uh the one in the suit and also uh the, at the end so you look you look at the hair you already know like you don't even have to wait for the claws or anything the hair is enough you know as soon as his head popped into the frame i was like yeah that's wolverine <laughs> so um again like i said this is gonna suffer the similar fate because they already met, like they already showed one person from the previous movies who's py uh, you know Pyro and with the TVA being there and with the you know uh uh you know Age of Ultron stuff and you know Wolverine being back I feel like uh, they're just gonna ride that cameo train and uh, I I feel like the reviews are gonna be based uh, a lot on how they do the cameos and how who who are they gonna bring back 
And like, like I said, this movie can totally suck, which I'm not really expect it, uh, expecting it to be. But like, I'm just saying this movie can totally suck. But depending on everybody they bring back, people are just going to be really happy. And they're just going to say like, oh, this is the greatest movie of all time, blah, blah, blah. Similar to, you know, No Way Home, because uh, everyone was, you know, saying how Toby and Andrew was going to come back, blah, blah, blah. And it happened. So automatically, you know, it became the greatest movie of all time, even though like that movie was heavily flawed and um and you know we go to multiverse of madness like like i said there were like a um, like i keep seeing uh rumors of people gonna cameo left and right and then when it didn't happen everyone was like oh that movie's shit so i feel like this movie is gonna suffer the same thing uh you know but i mean based on the trailers they already showed some people who are gonna return so i don't know who else uh, so is Pyro going to be the only person from the previous movies to return or are there going to be anybody else? So I'm not, I'm not sure. So um, I think I didn't miss anything else from this trailer. So uh, like, that's what I'm wondering when he was in the snow is that because again, there was the 20th century logo, which I, I assume is in the void. And also is that and the other all the snow places are the same place in the void or is, are, are those in like age of ultron because he did say he was going to change the the cinematic universe so uh are they going to send him to any specific point in time in the mcu honestly look if he is going to change anything in the mcu please go like anywhere after end game like don't touch anything before end game because before end game everything is perfect you know so he's going to go back to age of ultron so the only reason i can i can see why he's going to going back to age of ultron because since this is an x-men related project maybe they're going to involve um quicksilver or scarlet witch uh, wanda in any way because those two are mutants so maybe that's the reason why they showed age of ultron because that's the only movie uh pre uh you know I mean, not not for you. I mean, in, in the Infinity Saga that featured mutants. So uh, maybe that's the reason why. Because since this is an you know technically an X Men mutants related movie, that's why they're actually going back to that movie. Or uh, I don't know. So yeah, if you want to change anything, change anything that came out after Endgame. Don't touch anything before. Uh, <laughs> change everything else. Change um, you know. I don't know, change She-Hulk, change, um, uh, oh shit, what, what, I can't think of any, I don't know why, <laughs> what else, what else, I changed Secret Invasion, uh, change, um, I, I don't know why, I can't think of any right now, like, I always think about this shit, so I don't know, uh, I don't know, I, I can't think of any movies right now, I don't know why, bro. now that, when I'm supposed to think, I can't, so anyways, yeah, uh, really excited for this movie, uh, to see Wolverine back, uh, this is gonna be great, uh, this is coming out in July, so, um, again, the only MCU related project, uh, or movie to come out this year, I'm not even sure if there's any shows coming out from the MCU this year, but yeah, that is all for Deadpool 3, uh, you know, Deadpool and Wolverine trailer reaction. If you enjoyed this, give this video a like and comment down below what you thought about the trailer. So thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Take care. Goodbye.